The Bills get taken down by the Jets in New Jersey. Whoa, my Bills. <laughs> Now that I've gotten that out the way, let's talk the game. The Bills lost. They lost. You know why they lost? I'm going to tell you why they lost. The Bills couldn't establish the run. The Bills couldn't stop the run. Josh Allen, he played messy today. Josh Allen threw two interceptions. And the Bills couldn't establish that passing game. So when you put all those things together, you're going to lose football games if you're quarterback is playing messy, if he throws two interceptions, if you can't stop the running game, if you can't establish the running game, and if you can't establish even the passing game, guess what? You're going to lose ball games. Does that loss sting? Does that loss hurt? Hell yeah, it stings. Yeah, it hurts. But guess what? It's not that significant of a loss, guys. Because given the rest of the schedule, I can foresee the Bills possibly losing two more games. Now, the Jets wasn't one we were supposed to lose. But I can possibly see us losing two more games, maybe to Cincinnati and Cincinnati. And you might not agree with this, but maybe even to New England and New England. I don't know, but I foresee us losing two more games. We should coast the rest of the season, guys. The Bills was bound to have a floppy game. We won four in a row pretty impressively. And, you know, I'm not overly upset. I am upset, but not overly upset that we lost the game. But I gave you the reasons, in my opinion, why we lost. If you cannot establish the running game or stop the running game, you're not going to win ball games. If your quarterback is throwing interceptions, you're not going to win the ball game. However, the Bills are still number one in our conference. Okay? We're number one in our conference. Check that out. The Bills are number one in the AFC. No, as it stands today, you know, November 6th, we're still... Number one in our conference, we're number one in the AFC. And again, as far as the National Football League, we, we, we're number three, I believe, because you have the Eagles, and you have the Vikings, and you have Buffalo, then you have Dallas. So we're still looking good. Like, as of today, we're number three. We're number one in our conference and number one in the AFC. So there's nothing to get all upset about and all, up, you know, all bent out of shape because we lost this game. Make it a learning lesson, Buffalo. I'm sure that they will, and I'm sure they're going to come back stronger and better. So that's all I really got to say about this this week's game. You know, we lost. It's going to make us better. It's not as bad as it may look, but we're going to bounce back. The Bills always bounce back. They're going to look at the tapes. They're going to know what they did wrong. They're going to come back stronger, and we're going to win this coming Sunday. You guys take care. I hope you all enjoyed this. If you did, and if you didn't, please, please, please subscribe to my channel, guys. Like this video, and I'll see you all at the next Bills review. Bye. Yeah.